Hi, hey, and all those other greetings, side adventurers. I'm Jake's Bins, welcoming you all back to my gaming and unboxing channel, where today we will be playing some more Team Sonic Racing. But before we get into that, I must tell you guys, we have Jake's Bins Originals with script stories like Girl of Cyclones, Quincor, Flowlight, and old vlogs, as well as art videos, and before... Before we actually continue, as we usually do, I do need to say, because I always like to mention when there's uh, equipment change or a milestone, as I mentally call them, for different things. Now, I remember a lot, like for instance, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe was the first time I ever did a capture card playthrough. And that was pretty great. That was just amazing. And then I believe there was another one. Yeah, then the Elgato was Mario Kart 64. But anyway, enough milestone talk because, well, there's going to be. Anyway, though, I'm now using the Fifine mic, which I am still going to be using the Snowball. However, when I'm in my room... I'm going to be using this because I did do a Mario Kart 8 Deluxe stream where I explained this, but again, want to explain this again. My friend Brandon ended up telling me that this is a really good solo microphone and just in general pretty good and it was $30. So I figured, you know what, I'll get it and I'll use it in my room. If it's a little better, fine, whatever, you know, it's good for solo. Blue Snowball is good for multiple, so it, it works out. If it's worse, then it's it's slightly worse. Whatever. Doesn't really matter. Um, but the other change is that we're also in my room. As as you guys can probably tell. Which is, uh, which is now blue. And my bed is behind me. Which is why this wall is completely empty. Uh, because I don't want anything to fall on me while I'm sleeping. Now, the thing is though... Because this is my first time ever recording slash streaming, even though this is just recording, I need to stop footnoting my sentences. Um, but even though this is my first time recording in here, that doesn't mean everything is going to be completely set in stone. These angles where the TV is, which by the way, TV's right here, face cam is here, so if you see me looking here most of the time that would be why kind of also makes it look like i'm looking at the gameplay because the gameplay is right there so that's it's kind of fitting uh but hopefully in the future i'll be able to uh to change that but yeah we're in we're in my room so kind of spoilers for tanuka tail review but whatever um anyway though before we jump into anything too major we do also need to go through the garage, the mod pods. You guys know the drill by this point. I mean, if you guys have gotten to this point, that's actually pretty pretty sleek. Um, but if you guys have gotten to this point, then I'm kind of assuming that you either are curious about some of the stuff. Ooh, nice legendary. Um, some of the stuff that has actually happened with these missions, and you really want to know... Spinner? That's an interesting name. Um, you really want to know how to do a mission, or you guys have been with me for a while. Which, either way, thank you for being here. But, uh, yeah. By this point, you guys know we just throw a stupid amount of uh, things at this. And I think we're just going to get a bunch of legendaries now, because we've pretty much unlocked most of the general stuff. Sunset? Ooh, that that probably will look cool, but I don't know. Turbo Jets? Of course, now we're getting all the Sonic stuff, though. Um, but now that I think about it, I think we're pretty good. Um, I, I was kind of hoping to get more Rude stuff, but we'll get more Chow stuff. That's fine, too, because Chow eventually will probably need some changes. But, uh, it's Ridge's turn. Go figure. I mean, other than Xiao, 
I think Rouge is literally the only character left who has not gotten any car redesign whatsoever. So good thing that we got some new stuff. And we now have all the parts. So that's cool. All right, so we do have the front. Actually, that's not that bad looking. It's actually kind of cool. Uh, and then the backs. We've got that weird triangle heart thing, which that together actually looks pretty good. But of course, like that, having the heart and the booster, that looks really cool too. The glow. I figured, like, th it's weird that this looks sleek to me because I always hate those, like, metal rim type stuff. Alright, so that's going to be better for boost at least, so I'll do that. And the wheels, which I never like those wheels. I like these ones, though. Not that better handling will be great in the long run, but, you know. The, the nave spinners are actually pretty, pretty neat. Not gonna lie. And that would actually do a lot. But you know, of course, I've gotta be me and uh, choose the coolest, in my opinion, the coolest thing that I possibly can. So now that we've basically used a good seven minutes to explain things and all that, let's jump into the colors, which doesn't last long at all. Um. <laughs> So, the question is, do we really want to change? Because I really do like this co whole color scheme thing. You know, with like the dark brown and stuff. And we don't really have that many brown cars. I don't know, like, where I want to go with this. I was kind of hoping by this point we would have unlocked some, some new stuff. I, I really want to use this blue on something, but it's so god dang bright. Okay. Metallic paint's not that bad for it, though. Ooh, that? Okay. That with the metallic paint? Oh, but the purple. No, the purple's way better. Oh. I might, I might just do full metallic, man. I might, I might just have to. But God, look at how bright that is. Like an actual headlight. God, and there's so much blue on there. I think I'm gonna do maybe the pink. Yeah, that's not bad for the considering the gr the glacier land theme. I was like, eh, I don't know. It's so it's so like intense type of thing. All right, so what does the sunset one look like? Yeah, maybe I'll do something like that. But on the front, it also looks. Yeah. Okay. Now that we're 10 minutes in, sorry guys, um, I'll probably cut some of that stuff out just because a lot of it was just me being a little bit indecisive, and uh, that's kind of a long amount of time, and I wasn't expecting to take that long. Now, I would do this one. However, I have a feeling the one above it is the final showdown, so I really don't want to... Do that just yet. Uh, perform at least five successful team rival takedown scraped. But uh, why not take Rouge's tropical tropical car, which uh, so fitting for the team. Um, honestly, though, even though hers is ridiculous and in gameplay will probably look insane. <laughs> Which is basically what Rouge kind of is, you know, she's the glamour type of girl. The, give me jewels, give me diamonds, give me a fancy metallic car that is based in Sunset. You know, that's just Rouge. You know? All glimmer 
and all gold. You know? Usually it's like some glitter, some gold, or whatever. Oh, it is weird now looking at Omega's car and not seeing it be pink. <laughs> That's a weird thing for me to say, but uh, it looks weird now. Alright, and I'm now realizing that I got hit by a bomb. Um, yeah. Which, again, it would be nice if they, they had fixed that whole thing. But no. And first time I've hit that. But um, I'm realizing it's probably going to be very hard to uh, get some rival takedowns. Or stay in any place and get the amount of rings that I need. <laughs> um, but anyway, though, I found out apparently this game added... Or they're adding a collector's edition to this game. Which is mainly weird just for the fact that... Uh, Wow, Shadow, that was not helpful whatsoever. Well, I guess technically for this part of the mission. Um, but it's weird because they're doing a Classic Sonic statue, which Classic Sonic isn't even in the game. So I don't know, like, what idea they were going for. And, oh my god, the amount of turns in this track is so ridiculous. Oh my god. How am I going to do any of this? <laughs> the amount of obstacles and all that. Wow. Just like Mario Kart. Seriously, like the Mario Kart stream and my own teammate takes my item? Really? But yeah, uh, sorry if I'm like complaining a lot, but the thing is when you play a good, I don't know, like two hours of Mario Kart and you have a bunch of item problems... Yeah, that tends to end up happening, even if you're not necessarily meaning to complain. Oh, if I would have gotten that, that would have been kind of clean. Unfortunately, though, because now there's two missions, I also have to be extraordinary. <laughs> as, I, as I say while hitting so many freaking buttons... To be honest, though, I, I really should focus on the mission. Oh, my God. I just... Re I'm sorry. I just realized what the music is. Guys, it's the final boss from Sonic Adventure. Holy crap, guys. They added freaking Egg Viper. Oh, my God. That shortcut. What in the world? Oh, that takes you so far ahead. And Zavok. <laughs> I was waiting for Zavok to snipe him, and then he did that. And I was like, I feel way too bad to hit him now. Maybe I shouldn't have stayed behind to, uh, to do that. But if you can get that shortcut, that's such a massive thing. Like, that's crazy. Alright, I gotta get, I gotta get, like, three more rival takedown, two or three more. Which makes this a problem, because it keeps giving me things that I can't use in a rival takedown. Yes, thank you for the bomb. Even though I wasn't good aim. God, I hate that rival takedown. You have to be... To do missions like this, you actually have to be bad. It kind of sucks. <laughs> and yes, that is me partially bragging. <laughs> oh my God. Not that it matters if I don't have 75 rings anyway. Come on. Oh my god, I need the snipe, man. Oh yeah. All right, I'm just gonna say that it's it because I don't want to risk. Woo! Also, I can do that. Yeah, that uh, that music is me stealing first. That's what that is. Good, bad, ugly, whatever. <laughs> Doesn't matter because I stole I stole the crown, guys. But seriously, that, that shortcut 
it is not that hard to get, considering how broken it is. Like, that is wild to me. Alright, I think I missed it by, like, one. And if I missed it by one, I'm gonna be kind of sad. Because we've, we've only... D that was one mission, and we're, like, 17 minutes in. That's wild. That's even more wild. Whew. Alright, and we did get the key. Nice! So yeah, the music was very justified. Now I don't know what the end is. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, smash through at least 30 targets while drifting. And at least 30 with a wisp. Uh, I mean, I do kind of want to take Luigi's car out again. Because why not? <laughs> you know, Root said, I have not had enough of a spotlight in this. Especially with the beautiful cars that I've had. Listen, I cannot let them sit in Jay Leto's garage any longer. We are showing these off. And I'm like, okay, Rouge. Let's do it. And then I let go. Go of the gas button. <laughs> That's helpful. And then I start hearing the Avengers music. <laughs> Why am I hearing this as Avengers? Even though it's Sonic Heroes? Oh my god. That's Snipe on the 100, though. That's a zoom in. Oh my god. Okay, I'm getting fairly lucky considering how bad I'm doing. Oh, okay. Sorry if I'm focusing, but considering I have not played this track in a very long time and the, uh, the ridiculous amount of requirements for this. I mean, I'm using as many wisps as I can, man. I'm trying my best, and my best wasn't enough. But hey, we got we got silver. We got silver. We almost got gold, and I didn't pay attention to anything in that race. I just drifted, and I was like, throw a wisp, throw a wisp. Okay, I'd, I'd say it multiple times, but try saying throw wisp an annoyingly long amount of times doesn't work unfortunately just doesn't work that well but anyway though we are going to throw Rouge back into this because we need that key uh which might be a problem if it if it had been that last track that we played we'd be fine we'd have absolutely no problem with this with the whole like drift through the targets I'm, cur I'm curious if it's one of those you can do them at the same time, too. And then the summits. Okay. I gotta remember, though, I can let go of drift. This isn't a fully drift to heck challenge, you know? Whoa! Okay, that was unlucky. That was not good. Ah... Uh, I heard, I heard him say, Bewa beware the roaches. <laughs> For some weird reason. And this is not racism in Supergirl. <laughs> Which, if you didn't know, that's what, uh, in Supergirl, the uh, Children of Liberty call aliens. Yep. Finding new ways to be offensive. <laughs> oh, it's okay. It's okay. I got this. I almost made a full lap, and that's definitely not 30 wisps. Because it did the same thing. All right, guys. We might have to uh, 
Make some, some cuts. I doubt that it's 30, but I might as well try it anyway. Yeah, I did not surprise myself. Okay. It's definitely going to be a problem of doing them both and making sure they are both done. That sentence didn't really, <laughs> didn't really mash up. Okay, you know what? I technically made a full lap. And I almost... Okay, the key's definitely got to be past. <laughs> past that. Yeah. Wait, challenge complete? Guys, I did it! <laughs> Guys, I got that platinum! Okay, well that's cool. The question is, was it enough? Um, I did not expect to get that platinum. I did drift through a few... Is it a both or is it an either or? Oh my god, finally. I don't know when I got it, but I got that key. So basically, what you had to do is you had to do drifting into targets 30 times. And then throwing wisps at it 30 times. 30 different ones. Thanks. Th thanks. Thanks for that. Well, because of the intro and all that, and normally, I would go further because I feel like 
next episode should have been the finale. But that took so long and was so ridiculously stupid that uh, this is going to be the end of the episode. How do they keep making these missions worse? Just, just how? And of course, the next three... They have keys too. Great. And I don't know what they unlock. So there's also that. Anyway, though, guys, if you enjoyed, make sure to hit that like button and show us out without run no love. Brother, mother, sister, father, iguana. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Keep your toes safe. Thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you want to see more from this channel, make sure to go to the left of the screen for subscribing and subscribing to my other channel and go to the right of the screen to check other videos. All right, see you guys later. Bye.